Our verse today is Job chapter 42, verse 5. I had heard of you by the hearing of the ear, but now my eye sees you. Job raised so many questions about his condition. He was very confident that he was righteous and had not committed any sin that warranted all the evils that befell him. He was right from the human perspective. Job wanted God to calm down and respond to his questions. God should answer why he had to go through all the mishaps. God came down and listened to Job. God in turn asked Job a series of questions. Read chapters 40 and 41. In the end, Job owned up that he does not understand the ways of God. Our verse is a deep insight into our relationship with God. I had heard of you by the hearing of the ear, but now my eye sees you. There is a world apart between hearsay and experience. The experience changes my perception of the ways I see God and the way God acts. The Christianity of a hearsay person is very shallow. It is always based on what the pastor or the priest says. The Reverend Father said we should never do this or that. My pastor told me to do A or B. Such Christianity is infantile. It cannot last because there is no personal proof of what I have been told. I need to have a personal experience to be able to say yes, what this person is saying is correct or is not. But the Christianity based on experience can change what the Reverend Father or the pastor says when it is not in line with the basic Christian principles or is at variance with the scriptures. Because sometimes someone may be projecting his own personal ideas or image to the detriment of the scriptures or to what the Christian principles and taste. An experienced Christian is the one who raises questions when he or she is not satisfied or is worried about specific ideas. The faith went down in some parts of the world in the last few decades because it was rooted on an infantile foundation for many people. People recited prayers and memorized the catechism without a real experience of God in prayer or understanding and internalizing the catechism that they had learned. The good and experienced Christian is the one who listens. He hears the word of God. He goes home and reads it again personally, internalizes it and makes it a prayer and part of his life or her life. That is what experience does to us. Lord, I have heard so many things about you through the scriptures, the church and preachers. But I want to have a personal and deep experience with you in prayer. And I want to build a relationship that is solid. Please, Lord, help us with your spirit and open our eyes to see you. Amen. And I wish you a lovely day and God's blessings.